Hello, everyone. We're back with something that I lost a bet to with my cousin. And he, I let him pick a concept of the video, and he said, uh, Can you watch a bunch of e girl videos and react to them? And I said, Well, I've never seen an e girl video in my life before except for the one that was suggested to me on stream which was like a video game sounds one I thought it was really good that was pretty good so here we are and let's see if I can make it through this video without blowing my brains out also uh, most of these channels had try on videos like try on so and so I ain't gonna watch try on videos I put one in there because it's literally all she had but, I mean, I can't, I can't do it, dude. <laughs> I'm going to blow my brains out if we do that. I really am. But first, we, we're going to go to with uh, the one we know the most of. This is Amaranth. I think everyone knows Amaranth. Stretched canvas, and I've covered and it. The video is the most challenging Bob Ross painting. With a nice thin, even coat of the liquid white, which makes it wet, makes white. it slick. It allows wet us to actually slick. blend color right here on the canvas. Yes. So we have yeah. that ready. So let's get yeah. together and let's do a fantastic painting. I'm going to start off today with a, with a small amount of phthalo blue. And we'll just take and pull a little bit out and then tap the brush. That assures a nice even distribution brush. of color all the way through the brush. Just tap it. Just tap like so. Let's go right up here. Now then. Let's start right up in here, and we'll use little little crisscross strokes. Actually, Just make little X's. Is she actually painting herself? Let's put in a happy little cloud. His little brush sky. is bigger than mine. Okay, a little more of the color. Hold on. I gotta catch up, Bob. Do I have a bigger brush? That might be the biggest. Yes. What is going on? Looks like the biggest. Wait. Hold on, I'll catch up, Bob. It's going so fast. Damn it, Bob. <laughs> I need a bigger brush. I gotta keep up. Mm -hmm. I don't think Bob Ross ever thought a girl right. was gonna paint her food. You get all these fantastic little Over, effects automatically. Uh, you know, what do you do? Something that easy. That easy. You have a quick little sketch. Yeah, I don't think yeah, Bob well, Ross ever thought of that. Well, I have this on the brush. Tell you what, let's this add this little when amount of phthalo blue. Uh, or phthalo green. Tutorial. So we have phthalo blue and phthalo oh, blue. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. amount of the green. It's very strong. Oh, yeah, and how much did you go? Okay, we, need, we gotta go more. We gotta go more. Here we go. I'm gonna get, is this spread more. What is going call on Call me here? liquid white. What? He's calling me? Use my hands. Just finger painting. No, it'll stain my hands legit. It's okay. We'll make up for it. Here we go. He's a bigger brush. I know. I don't, I don't sell body painting brushes in the set with that big size. This is the biggest. Uh... She has there. massive boots. I didn't. I've never realized Oof. this. Yeah, I painted my whole body in titanium white. Also, maybe we'll have a little water in here. Um. So we'll just pull. Those can't be real, right? So like this. the paint. Very gentle. And pull. The paint that's going on her body. Is it gonna seep into the plastic in her boobs? Like, if she if she comes out of this and her boobs are blue forever, that's freaking hysterical. Amount of phthalo blue. Oh, blue. Thalo green. I mean. So we have blue and, green. blue and thalo green. Just a small amount of the green. It's the very strong. She has Let's on. go back up here. Maybe we'll have a little water in here. So we'll just pull. Oh, we're doing some water. Like some water. Order. Oh, you're gonna see. We're gonna fast forward here. You want, just wash you want the light? Now. If you've painted with me before, you know this is the fun part. No. And we wash our brushes I don't th with odorless thinner. <laughs> Shake off the excess. Yeah, I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> Just beat the devil out of it. All right, now with a nice clean brush, now we'll go right back. That's because she is the devil. Bob Ross would be rolling in his grave at this. Back up here, and we'll just blend the sky out a little bit. Still using a little crisscross strokes. Now you can work this guy until it's absolutely dead, or you can leave some of these little dark and light areas in it to give it some life. That easy. Okay. Now then, let's make it, let's make some big fluffy clouds today. I'm gonna go right into the titanium white with a one-inch brush. It's very strong. Heat up your whole world. Titanium white. 
Okay, load a lot of paint for us. Let's go like get it. And maybe there's a happy little cloud that just sort of float right around in the sky and have fun. This is your world. So you creep in. Okay, okay, okay. All right, Bob. Those are nice, some nice clouds. What is that going on there? All right. Me, uh. It is an interesting concept. I gotta be honest. Clouds. All right, blend this. She's doing better than I would. He's in a hurry. He is. He's Maybe feeding. I should draw my tits. Got her clouds. Tell you what, I live in Alaska, and I, I really like mountains. Mountain. So let's do a fantastic little mountain there. I'm gonna take some black, some Prussian blue, some Van Dyke brown, a lizard crimson in there too. Be careful with the crimson. Make it brown. Or your mountain will turn purple, which is all right. We just sort of make. Bob Ross is just making up freaking color names at this point. He's just making stuff up. A decision. Put it. Mountains growing. That's a big ass mountain. Okay. How are you drawing this without looking at this? Too much boob sweat, can't paint. That's right. Boob he wants sweat? us to put snow on the mountain? Yeah, she's doing way better than I would do. You can do anything on this canvas. You can do anything. I'm gonna take some white, we'll put a little. Pull it out very flat again. Cut across. Let's go back up. Gotta load that knife. Is it like a light blue color now? Put those shadows in there. If you add a shadow, and it becomes a separate entity. You need some more, do some more snow. Unbelievable. There. All I'm doing is tapping. Always follow the angles that you've created in your mountains. Just really load it full of paint. She's actually doing right a really good job. It's like a greenish. The footy hill is right here. And all yeah. I'm doing is just tapping. Isn't that fantastic? Look at all the little, uh -huh. little things it makes in there. Isn't that a super easy way to well, make that, that is definitely not Just the, color the base there, but it don't what are you have doing? the top. You're ruining it. And soften that. It does not have to be difficult. You don't have to be blessed by Michelangelo at birth to be able to paint. You can do it. Uh, Michelangelo would be layer so proud layer of Bob Ross. Layer. Okay, now okay. here's a fan. All right. Hold on, Bob. This color is a little darker, so it stands out. Gotta catch up. That looks mm -hmm. awful. Bob speed running his. You're, you're Apparently, he learned to paint in the military on his brakes. And he learned to paint fast because the brakes weren't that long. Um, okay. What? Now what, Bob? Traditional painter. All you what do are you talking it about? What? And pull it down. Where the trees are taller, pull down a little further. Look at that. Look at that. Just the corner of the brush. Oh, yeah, we're doing the trees. Yeah, working back and forth. Okay, hold on. Let me put my little line in here. You gotta put some arms on this tree. Gotta give him some little, little arms so he can reach up and gather the sun up. Look at there. Look at there. Something like that. Ow, oh, I'm off center. It's hard to see. Back and forth. And we gotta put some arms on this tree. Gotta give him some little, little arms so he can reach up and gather the sun up. Honestly, it's a pretty good concept, Amber. This there. is pretty I'll good. I'll fix it. Maybe like the stem, I guess. And then it's hard to see what I'm doing here. Something uh -huh. like that. Roughly. Right. Tree. The fat ass tree. Right. Each tree. Oh, it's thick. I did a totally different type of tree. <laughs> I couldn't see it very well. Okay, Bob. It's a different species of tree. That's fine. I got a, sh I got a fat ass tree. Thick. Straight line. Nice. Honest here for her not being able to see very well. It looks pretty good, oh, right? Like, tree. We agree, we can oh, agree. that's great, Bob. I wish I had your brush. I really do think half the battle is the right to the brush. Would you let Bob Ross paint your boobs if he was alive? Absolutely. Who wouldn't? Everyone would let Bob Ross paint their boobs. If you, if you wouldn't, you're lying. You would never want to wash it. I would let so Bob pretty. Ross paint my boobs. Sure. Yeah. Kind of tattoo would just Absolutely. Might want to have the same effect because I'm not. I don't think um, he would. Doing it from the side. The real estate's telling me that the cedars take up all the water, and if you want your oak trees to thrive, you have to dig up the cedars. When you have this kind of power, you can move lakes anywhere you want. Mm -hmm. we just put the indication of a happy little tree trunk here. And there. I don't need the tree trunks, Bob. It's too much effort for this. A spatula? Yeah, I do. Why is it like this yellow? <laughs> Thank you. 
I mean, it was a video of a woman painting her boobs. Like, I don't know why people watch it, but we're going to move on now. Uh, 8 out of 10, just because it takes a lot of talent. She did a pretty good job. This one is, oh, we all know this lady, don't we? Belle Delphine. And this is five months ago, pretending that I'm going on an adventure, but I'm in my bedroom. This seems very strange. All right, here we go. Is this going to be copyrighted? Bell, what are you doing? Are we, hold on, we'll pick a different one. Give me a we'll pick a different one. We'll go back. Give me a second. All right. There we go. Meet my best friend. It has 11 million views. There's not many videos on Belle Delphine's channel. Oh, heck, she's pretty good in front of this bell please get bell oh god <laughs> i can't like i don't even know what to say it's so strange what are the chances someone whacked off to this video just started jerking off to the octopus oh there's that bath water she was selling You stop that right now. I just. Why would you put. Why would you do this? Please tell me she doesn't have the. Oh, God. Let me put it on your body. Is she making like a is she making a hentai reference? Is that the whole the whole joke? Tentacles, right? Oh, 
It's a different toothbrush. I thought she put I thought she put that toothbrush in her mouth. <sighs> Alright, that's it. Uh that was horrible. Two out of ten, I hate it. Get me out of here, dude. I g I gotta I need to, to pray for that. Uh here we go. One kill, one remove clothing League of Legend challenge. Gone too far. This is a lorry. I knew she- Yo, ew! I'm scared! Shut down. Uh-oh. <laughs> yes! 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 No. Okay. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have a strip league video with- Hi, I'm Kitty. I'm happy to be here. Yeah, and hope you enjoy the video. Does she actually talk like that or is she making that voice up? That's so annoying. There's no way she sounds like that in real life, right? Like it hurts my ear. Level up. Oh my god. Uh oh. <laughs> Gamer oh sounds. <laughs> Minecraft. <laughs> I've never played League of Legends and I never will. Ah, the tower. No, the tower. Oh, you no. suck. <laughs> I'm sad. I look like a little no, girl not. very, very lost in the forest. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have my arrow. Wow! Mm -hmm. What happened? Wow, it's a big beer. Like my... Oh. <gasps> beer. Wow, that's so cool. She's from another country. <laughs> oh, he killed my baby beer. <laughs> oh, he's destroyed. <laughs> ah, they are here. Oh my god, no. You ready? And they you know, I'm going through these videos, I and I, ah, I'm, I I'm can't scared. imagine sitting on the internet, like no, on YouTube, being all day, like, ah. like in my with like pants all like wow. this. Wow! Like, wow! That's oh, the, oh, the, oh, I want the oh, oh okay. Damn. Look at my beer! Look at my like, beer! Gotta, ah. gotta get, I gotta throw money I at love him. The beer. No, I like too, I like money too much. To, and I have too much self-respect to watch more. Uh oh. Videos of these <laughs> and the ones I'm watching. I'm joking. Mm, I'm mad. Okay, revenge. <laughs> revenge? Oh, by the way, you, you had to strip because you died. Oh, yeah, I, I can now. That's a foot. Disappointing. Come here. Come here. I must say, the editing's really well I'm done. I'm trying to strip and play at the same time. <laughs> Uh, I'm scared. Ah, I see you, I see you. Okay, perfect. I don't know. French? <laughs> Why does save she me, can you save me now? Phone? Save me, save me. Ah, uh, Z. Ah! Like that? Say angel. It's no. Hair. Yes. <laughs> oh, fuck. No, I'm doing. No. <laughs> fuck. Okay. Whoa. Oh, this sucks. Watch your language. <laughs> Bruh. Got a strip now, too. Uh-oh. Yes! They stand no chance against us. Yeah, no, that's true. Okay, I put my beep. Oh, these guys will die. Is this common? Yes. Like, <gasps> yes. girl strip for game? Ah. Game death? No, no, no. You got this. Get him. This is my favorite death! You didn't do You can't really do this. Like, Get I like Can smite. You save me, save I play a lot of smite. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See, you can die at like five. Like Thank you. Maybe My seven beer times is good as match. fuck. Like, what are you gonna right? do? You, you die like, yeah. this, like 13 times. I think you die so no. terrible. What are you gonna do? No, no, You're no, gonna no, be no. naked. Oh, look at the class. Look at the moves. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Dead. Oh, we got a trip again. Okay, me too. I die. How many clothes do you have on you now? I only took off one. I got... Okay, I'm gonna take off my headband. Okay, I'm gonna take off my shirt now. Yes! I'm feet free right now. <laughs> uh oh, she has an under cam. Uh, I'm here, I'm here. Okay. Okay, I'm here now. But like. The editing is well done. I mean, like, it's not Wait, even here for the booze. This, this is just freaking funny. 
genuinely Why is he dancing in front of me, huh? Yeah. You gotta chase him. Let's get him. Let's get him. He's laughing at us. It's not uh -huh. fair. <laughs> but, like, people get watch him. this stuff and... For reasons that I would... It's fucked. No, they kill me. You could, you could look uh, up at Can I do B now? Yeah, I came back now. Okay, B. You I come back to, very quickly. You don't have to. I have no life, but my B is like, he's here. <laughs> Did she say? I have no idea what she said. Oh no, you died? Oh. No! They come. No, Papu. Why you kill them with a bear? With a bear? Oh yeah, but they, they killed me. French, I was right? like, it has I was to cute. Be. Mm. Canadian. <laughs> Maybe. You gotta strip again. I'm naked soon. Yes! 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 Yeah. Very nice. Not have yeah, socks. Take off my lot, shirt too. Okay, let's go. I gotta see. No, there is the big guy. <laughs> yeah, I want to get the big guy. Why did she say guy again? Let's, but let's I do gotta that. say. Look at him. Bye, have a great you know. time. Look fun, bro. They don't look oh. bad. Ah! It's just this like, is a mess. This is a mess. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna not die. Like no, 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 no. I don't have clothes. No, kill me. No. no. Kill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they kill me. But you died. Uh, j just here. Where you are now. I die just here. <laughs> Lauren's actually good at this game. <laughs> Holy we gotta crap. take their base. Let's go together. Okay. Yeah. No. No. No way. Everyone was on us. Oh my god. The neither <laughs> They lose. What? This is cheating. Oh my god. They be cheating. Okay, I'm with my beer. No way, no way. They kill me again. <gasps> but everyone is here now. Oh. <laughs> What's so easy for them? Like, <gasps> okay, we lost them. You gotta strip it. Yeah. Um Okay. Definitely interesting. Day in the next is uh let's see. Well meet my best friend was two. I would say really good edits. Seven out of ten. Seven out of ten. Yeah, for sure. Here we go. Day in the life of an e girl. Wow, here we are. Box. Otherwise, my skin. Before I before I start with this, this is by Shane. Sean Shane, the pizza waffle. Okay. It's just like dry. As Again with the blue. Lately, I've been so into Korean beauty, so I've been doing daily sheet masks. I'm gonna put this on. I thought I'd do a little what? day in my life slash get ready with me. Get ready with. Excuse the big R forehead. Got my little sheet mask here. Yeah, put it on and then have a bar. I barely have baths anymore. I've got to be like in the mood Bad? for one, but I went to a big time rush concert last night and I Why? felt like sticky. Wait. So. Wait, you went to we are having a deep soak Hold today. Hold on. I'm about to look crazy and sometimes I answer the door for parcels like this and they just give me a weird look. What does this do for you? I'm gonna go have a bath and then be back. 
one of the best things I do. Why don't put your hand over the camera like this? What are you doing? Cubes. You had a and wait. I get the lemons. My fridge is a state. We don't talk about it. Yeah, lemons. I'll cut up half a lemon and then make some lemon water because apparently it's good for you. Is this is this? You, a negro life? This is just a normal just human life. being life, except for the mask part so and the blue hair. If the literature being read to the oh, child God. isn't entertaining to the parent, throw it away. That's a cat. That's a really adorable cat. Look I'm at that cat. I'm taking my eyes face wipes and just go around my face with it. Look at her veins. Her veins. You can see her veins. Sometimes, so this helps so much. Drink my lemon water. She has really nice eyes, I'll tell you that Can much. My makeup? Can we all just pretend this is the okay. most insane voiceover ever? Like, go comment laughing emojis or something? Because I don't know what to say. Makeup and hair. Yeah, well. Done. Now, to be honest, I just kind of. Makeup helps. Until I want for to sure. Stream. So I might. You just walk around until you stream. My parents are coming over tomorrow, so today is kind of like a cleaning day for me. So I have just got some new pillowcases for my sofa. I just got these from Amazon. Um. I thought they'd be cute. Oh, oh, that's so cute. Oh, I'm in love. My little baby. Who's your sister? I have another it, cat it, it, It's, it's she physically just, like, hurts to watch these. She feels like, like I'm in he pain. So clingy. He'll follow me anywhere. Deep down. I could be doing the next Hi. theology set. I love it. Like I could be making videos, but we're here. I got another in my sadness. Fish in case. Open. Oh, I don't know how people are like all aesthetic when they open things. It's like when your grandparents do your Christmas presents and they wrap it in that like impossible, impossible wrapping Well, my, my grandmother is dead. It just so. looks a bit flat. I, I don't, you know, I don't think that's how that works. Where's the zip? Where is the zip? Where is the zip? Where's the zip? What? Please Why say, hold, who doesn't say zipper? What? I'm more annoyed by that than like anything else in the video. Where's the zip? Where's the zip? You're not four. So How do you do this? I'm googling this shit because I can't open the pillowcase. I'm not crazy. They put the zip in the middle of the pillowcase. I feel like that's such a dumb place. Like, since when is there a zip in the middle of the pillowcase? A lot of pillowcases do that. My pillowcases do that. Have you not seen a pillowcase? Like, I know they put them on the side before, but, like, nice pillowcases put them in the middle. It's true. They do. Man, I don't want to talk about it. See, why What do you mean you don't want to... What do you haven't been talking about anything so far? Ever. They got me two pillows. I'm so going to sleep on that and die at blue by accident. I'm gonna go round the house with a bin bag and just tidy up. Make sure there's no rubbish anywhere. I'm not gonna film that though because that's gonna be so boring to watch. <laughs> Did learn a life hack this whole that thing just is really helped to watch, me, especially lady. because I have ADHD. I feel like my place gets messy so fast. Find a place well, for I, everything. You know, I have ADHD everything has to have a place. Like these crisps, so. I don't know why they're on the sofa. They're uh, going you, into the cupboard. You have ADHD into the cupboard there, with the other crisps and stuff. Not clean. But honestly, like having a place for everything, it makes time so much easier. Well, this is true. true. Is she in England or something? You do not wear that skirt around your house. So the hoovering for this video. is done. She's I'm lying. The That's not no normal girl wears up. a skirt like that. That's for dinner today, not how I'm just going to make a quick stir fry. Four minutes and three and a half. You want my walk? Let's go. Thank you.
won't we? Look at all those vegetables. Uh huh. Oh, Titties is respawned. Did you? Hello. Oh, such. That is so much cringe. I'm One, Titties is a pretty funny name oh. for a cat. They have a love She said respawned for a cat. I'm my carpet. Okay, or, or, did you get the joke? I'm oh, gonna watch God. some TV and eat, and then I'm gonna stream. Usually I just sit here and watch I Grey's hate Anatomy. Watch TV. Oh, you're eating. Oh, eating food. Okay, so I've eaten dinner. I am just gonna play with the cats for like 20 minutes. Just to get the daily exercise in. I do this like every day. Sometimes I have to You mean exercise for the cats, today. not for he you. Loves playing. It's time to stream. I've got the LEDs all on. And now we're gonna turn on the PC for the first time today. Let's do some serious gaming. I set up these lights that I need to turn on. So I have this big boy light and then a little ring light. So I use this one to give me a little bit of color. And then that one just to color. brighten things up. So because it's 10 p.m. I do need a little bit of G fuel just to- Have coffee like a freaking normal person. Who's, I don't know. Do you know how unhealthy G Fuel is? Go get some Dunkin' iced coffee or Starbucks, okay? Hmm. Look at that, that's Dunkin'. My adrenal glands will still hate me, but thank me more than G Fuel. Wake me up. So I just Not take like a scoop in the of that morning. and mix it in with some water just to give me some energy. Ooh. Otherwise, if I stream without this, I'll be so like quiet and no one wants that. No one's gonna watch, let's be real. I don't have no a shaker, so anyway. I'll just use a fork. It's blue to match her hair. Bro, ski dude, you can't make this up if you cried. This is kind of like pre-workout for those gym people out there. Pre-workout? Ew. Wait, and then I have, like, a little if you don't like it, don't down. drink it. To drink whilst I stream. So this is the layout I use when I stream. I have stream labs up here and I stream to TikTok and Twitch at the same time. I yeah, I do that alerts, too. Okay, yeah. Fortnite, Spotify, and then Discord. Discord. Right now I'm just waiting for Fortnite to update. And so guess what? I do all of that on one monitor. Well no, that's not true. I have another Instagram, computer over here. But I do all of that Snapchat, pretty much. That's on what one I do monitor. every time I stream to let people know that I'm streaming. To you today, slash tonight. It's still laggy. I don't know what to what is this song? What is this song? Say you it. don't know what to do. Say it, guys. You know what you do? Yeah, look at this. Hi, YouTube. I'm live. I just ended. That was a really fun stream. I was playing Fortnite with viewers. It was very fun. But now I just sit here for like two to three hours. Might hop on a Discord call with my friends, but I'll probably be editing. So that is my day. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. I mean, let's be honest here. It gave us insight in the life of the e-girl as promised, but I didn't need that in my life. I didn't need to know that. And second, you didn't really do much of anything. You ate food, played with your cats, and then played video games. It wasn't very productive. Was, you know, I mean... You didn't do anything. You watched TV. I We saw it. Okay. Guess. All right. Here we go. This is Sahara, Sarah, Sahara, nine years ago, so this is relatively old. How to paint your amiibo. But Everyone, today I'm going to show you how to personalize and paint your very own amiibo. Okay.
Okay. Whether it's just because you want to add some customization to your uh -huh. collection, or because you want it to match the color you play in Smash, I'm going to show you how to personalize your very own amiibo to your likings. Yeah, I want now, to see I how you Now I made my little this. Mario, a little like Fire Mario theme, and I think he looks really good, and I'm really proud about how he came out. Uh -huh. And it just made sense to me because he yeah, has his little fireball, and he's like pew. He looks great with my collection. That's All right, cool. guys, so let's get started. All right, so obviously let's the first thing that you're going to be there. needing is an amiibo that you'd wait. like to paint. Can't wait to paint my Mario amiibo. Some Clear acrylic matte coating. What do you need that for? Some acrylic paint. And a reference picture to make sure that you're doing the correct thing. So first you're going to want to unbox your amiibo. Yay! Now you're going to want to cover the trophy part in masking tape just to protect it for when you paint it and spray it with the matte coating. This is actually pretty useful video. This is really important, so make sure you cover him all up Are you playing where music? He we don't want to hear that music. We can get copyright strike. What are you doing, lady? this is just me moving on to painting. Obviously, Wait, the what? first coat is going to be really, really watery and really gross. <laughs> <laughs> I look so funny when I paint things, but Why as you can you... see, I'm really concentrating and trying to get it on the dot. You don't look funny at all. You as look you can like see, a person. the first coating isn't very good. Good. Yeah. But don't worry, just wait a few more coatings, and we will be almost finished. My mom's feeding me crackers. <laughs> That's a great mother. Too much! Stop! That's pretty cringe. I'll let it slide because this video is nine years old. As you can see, I talk a lot while I paint. Okay. If you ever mess up, make sure you can use a Q-tip just to cover that all up. Q-tip? That's useful information, actually. Now right here I'm moving on to the red paint on his overalls. And ta-da! The first coat of the red and white paint is completed. So and looks, now we can move on right, to the okay. rest of our paint job. You let it dry and then you gotta paint over it. I took a toothpick really quick and I went over the parts that I kind of messed up on. Uh, again, After the this isn't is so finished, bad. It looks a lot better. I don't mind this one. Uh huh. You can even see a great difference in how much better the overalls looked, especially with the dark blue. Oh, by the way, the last it. video I didn't give it. It was like a three out of ten. I didn't need to watch it. I'm giving this like. This is a 7 out of 10. She does, she's actually teaching me something. And I I, I'm really kind of. This is not so bad. So, this is our second Labeled coat, as an e girl, but I mean. Moving on, what I like to call the water good coat, at, because we're going just to be pretty good. mixing our paint in with a little bit of Editing's water. Editing's good. And this is just me. Tutorial is good. <laughs> She's actually a normal human being. She seems normal. All right, so now it's time for the water coat where we mix our paint in with a little bit of water just to give it that sort of finer look and it makes it look a lot more even, makes the paint not look as gross. Uh -huh. And it really helps to not only even out the paint, but even out a lot of missing spots that Does it. might have appeared that you might have forgotten. And of course, if it drips a little bit, you can just wipe that up with a paper towel. Alright guys, this is my completed Mario Amiibo. Now all we have to do is spray him with the acrylic matte spray paint and we will be finished. Wait, why would you... wait, what? 
Why, why, why are you doing that? Just make sure you fold it far enough away for where it won't ruin the amiibo, but it will be just close enough to where it will do some effect. Perfect, now we're going to leave our amiibo to dry. And this is our final product. He looks great in any collection. It's very personalized, and it really stands out. Okay, guys, so I hope... Uh, 7 out of 10. I learned something. Didn't have much to say. Turned out pretty well. Neat. Next... Uh, it's Desi and welcome Desi's mukbang for Japanese food. Back I to my to YouTube channel. Today we are trying mukbang, some Japanese mukbang. snacks. Curly Q from Instagram sent these to me. So I wonder how many so people much. watch these videos and just my own, and I'm only really watch them. them out. So let's get started. Uh, so I'm just gonna, like, close my eyes. You know, just for the girls. Gonna see, and I'm going to pull and we're going to just see what we the... get. This is the first one. Okay, so this looks like it's Pokemon. This is this is definitely for like kids. So why is there a bunch of alcohol in the corner? What are you doing, Desi? What are you doing in your free time? To try this out. What are you doing? Ooh, okay, so it's is that a huge square. Wait, like a that's an SNES controller with chocolate. Mario things. That's super Ooh, cool. But yeah, I want to see that. A that's Ooh, super that's cool. So cool. It's really shiny. Shiny sticker. Okay, now let's try this out. Mm, it's really good. Yeah, don't eat. What, you're not gonna. You're. They. They don't eat that. She's probably gonna spit this out or throw up later, based on her size. She's not eating any of this. Yeah, this is this is a mukbang video for sure. You open it. Ooh, it smells like a very strong peach flavor. I'm is a it a peaches, peach flavor? Fuzzy peaches, so we'll see if it is kind of similar. Is that what we're? we're it it's a very. It looks very peachy. You don't eat it that way. Well, no, so really you nice. don't. So no, like you don't. No way did I see okay, her yeah, so eat it. A I, I mean, in between it, it's really good. I'm not usually. I'm sure it jelly, is. But this one's really nice because it's not super like gummy. It's more of like a fluffy kind of texture. <laughs> Out of those two, I think the peach one is definitely a favorite for me so far. So let's try. You've only had like three things. Time. And it says three chilies. So I don't know if that is really, really spicy or if it's not really spicy. Let's give it a go and see. Yes. But he looks pretty angry. So I think that, that means it's really spicy. Let's give it a sniff test. I am not like them or Ooh, the others. Don't back down. I don't run for cover and the crowd goes It doesn't smell too bad So let's try to put What do you mean too bad? Oh, it's bacon In the mouth and see how it goes <laughs> It's really good It's not too too spicy But it might be the type of spicy where When you eat oh. it first it's okay But then Why would you <laughs> give you the sounds to make it, it seem a little bit hotter. hotter I'm into it, this is really good Mr. Pig, whatever you are, you're good for me, the spice isn't too bad, but maybe someone who can't handle spice, this might be a little bit spicy for them. Let's try some hockey. This one's we a classic know, chocolate, which I've had before. And then I saw this one at the store as well, which is, is blueberry lady. flavor. Let's try the pocky out. It's like a pretzel stick with chocolate, which you can't go wrong about. I like. I... And they just go down so easily. <laughs> Have you guys? I'm seen naming that this the Dawn TikTok? Suffers the like, e-girl videos. Do. Because it's, mm -hmm. I'm suffering. This is torture. <laughs> and then there goes two poppy sticks. This is sticks. torture. I am losing and my brain. And then the blueberry stuff. flavor. This one's unique because I haven't seen me. this one before. And this instead hurts of having me. the pretzel Deep stick, it looks like inside. it's a little bit more of a pink stick. It does. With hearts on it. So cute. It has little hearts. And then it's blue. Did you put a wow mean in there, lady? Mm, this one is so good. This one tastes more like yogurt. Does it? And then this one's more like chocolate. So this one kind of tastes like blueberry yogurt. No yogurt, dip, which Sherlock. Tastes like a breakfast kind of snack. So good. Captain Ivy is striking again. Definitely try it out. Next on the list. Okay, this one's been calling my name. Fruity gummy corn. Gummy corn. And it looks like it has some type of 
corn filling. Let's see what we can get. Yes, as I thought, it's exactly like the peach ones. So it has a little pocket for the little gummy corn. So it opens up like this. It's so cute. It's like, ta-da, here's the corn. Oh my gosh, it smells like corn, but it's cute. Look at how cute that is. Oh my gosh, it is adorable. Let's give it a go. Let me guess, here's. it tastes like sweet corn. Or azitakimasu. I'm pretty sure that is. <laughs> Please. Mm. It's Please very, very out. mild. It also has that filling right in the center there. Please. So let's try to taste that filling a little Please bit. someone shoot me. Take me out. Mm. It's kind of like honey. It's not bad. It tastes oh, yeah. a lot sweeter than it smells. And there's no Ugh. saltiness on it. It's almost like, Ugh. you know, butter popcorn flavor. It's kind of like that popcorn, right? Yay for corn! It's corn! This is something else I actually picked up myself because I have good? never seen them before. I'm obsessed with Kit Kats. If you guys know me, Everyone's I obsessed love with Kit Kats. Kit Kats. Everyone it's a peach flavor. I've tried almost every flavor besides what peach. What was that? So I'm really excited for this. This one also has what the flowers on it, so I just what? really thought the packaging honestly was so pretty. So also, like, the yes. nose ring does not fit if that whole style. This could be a perfume, I'd wear it. <laughs> So this is Does how not the match Kit Kat your, looks. It's your, a cute what you're like going pink for. Color. Let's give it a try. It's not fashionable. What? Why do you eat like mm. that? It's so good. I think this is like one of my favorite flavors of Kit Kats. Nothing can beat the milk chocolate, but green tea and peach definitely are tied for second place. So this kind of tastes like as if you had strawberry milk, but it's peach milk instead. All right, guys. Curly Q also gave but then me this it's not little strawberry package, milk. so we're gonna go ahead and open it up. Oh <laughs> my gosh. Okay, these are little jiggly puff. I think they're hair bands. Look at this. They have little stars in them. They're hair bands? And you can like That's shake a... them. Oh, yeah, I thought it was cool. And these look like little jiggly puff hair bands. These are so cute. That is adorable. Thank you so much. So Carly Q actually lives in Japan, which is why she was able to send me all this stuff. It is my mission to eventually go to Japan myself so I can travel and explore because Japan looks like such a beautiful place to go. Oh, do you like them? I'm not going to Japan, dude. So cute. There I have no reason to go to Japan. I would get video games. Keychain. Japanese video games seem EVE cool, but other than that, I, like, I don't really care so to go. Cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, Sanrio characters and Hello Kitty. These are so cute that I guess they're like little, little, little uh, figurines or something. I or thought this was a Mustang. What are, I what hope are you I doing? get. Honestly, I'd be happy with them all. I don't care about so this cute. garbage. Oh, oh, it's a keychain. It's like a little baby much. bottle and then he's inside and what he goes back in What is that? I'm obsessed. This is so cute. Look at this little keychain. Oh. That is so cool. And then we got some Star V Pokemon cards. So cool. It comes with Pokemon cards. We're gonna grab cards. Corey to come open these with me because he loves to open Pokemon cards. Whoa. Japanese ones. Whoa. Say hi, this is Corey, guys. What's up, everyone? <laughs> All right. Gotta yeah, be careful. This could be like worth a lot. That's why I want you to help me because I'm so oh, bad at opening. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm I, so I, bad at opening Pokemon cards. Uh, I know cards. this guy is a big YouTube channel, but oh, I've, I've, I've never watched it. Oh, I think there's a hollow in there. Oh, I see the hollow. Oh, same, same. Oh, oh. damn! Whoa! Whoa! Wow! Uh, there's so Such many! Alright, this is cool. This is kind of cool in Japanese yeah. writing. Yeah. Whoa, no, this that's my favorite right there. Wow. This one. Okay, wait, show it to the camera Boom. and get closer. They all are so pretty. Let me see that yeah, one. Yeah, that is. Look at that. That looks yeah. legendary. Wow. Whoa! So, For some reason, it, looks, it feels so much more exotic. <laughs> Japanese. Oh, oh, whoa, look at that. That looks so Dude, cool. Dude, they actually got Rossi. pretty good right, right, cards right. out of this. Whoa, Ooh. nice, getting guy. Oh, look at that, they're look ripped. Look at it, yeah, I know, what, what the, the heck? heck? Wow, it's a blue Magikarp. Ah, so pretty. Wow, Is it blue, did you say blue Magikarp? A <laughs> blue Magikarp? Are you insane? Is that, is that so cool! Thank Fabian? you so much. Okay. These are so nice. They're so beautiful. <laughs> These are just look anything in Japanese. Just just stop being excited. Cooler, you know, your fake you. excitement. <laughs> <laughs> hey, get back there with my time to get back to the snack attack. <laughs> Why am I so lame? And next, let's 
try. These are like little bottles of candy and I've been eyeing them as well and they look so cool. There's a pink, a yellow, and a blue. Also guys, if you've been liking this snack haul, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more. It almost smells like, you know how you make cotton candy and you pour the sugar in to make cotton candy? It kind of smells like that. I'm gonna try the pink one because pink is my favorite color. I can eat a bunch of good I don't Gross always garbage. have one to two hours in my day to actually prepare a meal and then clean up after. Yep, it's sugar. It has a little bit of tartness. I'll try a little bit of each though because sugar is amazing. Sugar. Sugar. They all taste the same, but it's amazing. And sugar, how can you go wrong with sugar? It tastes good. If you want that kind of sugar rush, just, you know what I mean? Next thing are- no, uh, no. No, because sugar rush don't exist. You actually just get really sleepy and tired because your body can't handle it correctly. That's not how that works. These meaty kind of Oreo looking cookies. It looks like they yeah, it looks are like rich an Oreo chocolate sand strawberry. 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 Rich chocolate sand. Let's try it out though. I'll let you know if it's chocolate sand. So they come in these cute little packages. Ooh, they look like they're coated in something because they're a little bit faded. It smells like strawberry, it smells like chocolate. Because it's strawberry and chocolate. They're really good. They do nuts. taste just like Oreo, like strawberry Oreos. It's strawberry chocolate and then chocolate wafer, and it's really nice. Put the next thing here. Let's go for this little slow poke here. He's protecting the little kids. How many Pokemon jar. things is wow, there over there? This is so cute. Right there, if you can see. Let's try the candy out. Okay, and that pops up. Stop, his legs are inside too. That's so cute. And so when you take off the lid, his little legs are. <laughs> okay, they let's try one of these there. little Pokemon candies. This one's the pink one. I, it's I a mean... nice little strawberry flavor, but it's this jar that I'm obsessed with. Perfect. What is so, that? So, next thing is, I think this is another, not candy, but I think this is like a little character figurine. I really either want the Jigglypuff or the Pikachu. There's other things <gasps> that come from Japan Yay! that isn't Pokemon. I got the one sure. I wanted. Oh my gosh. Oh, Look at that. Like, Okay, how cute. <laughs> I love it. I can't wait to put this in my little glass case. Perfect. Okay, wait, now back to the what candy is, again. What? Let's try these. It? This looks like citrus and peach little jellies. It looks like the little packages that you open and then you squeeze them into your mouth. Let's give them a try. Definitely has the peach flavor. Tastes a little bit more artificial peach though. And then this one is the lemon flavor. Okay. The lemon one's really good. The lemon one kind of almost tastes like Sprite. And there's so many, which is amazing. Next, let's try these. These are little hard candies as well. <laughs> Looks like this. Let's try, try a green one this time. This is the little frog man. So I'm guessing this is lemon, frog uh, man? not lemon, melon flavor. So let's give it a try. I don't know if it's melon flavor. It kind of tastes like a soda. Mmm, it's really good. Here. It has kind of like a, Definitely gonna spit a sweet it out. but sour taste, and it almost tastes kind of fizzy. And then fizzy. we have what? these yummy little clusters. I'm not kind of sure. I'm not sure want, what these are. They look are you like gonna eat the hot mama? Clusters. Very elegant. It has gold. And That's brown. what I want to see. Very Cluster delicious. Let's enjoy nostalgic time. Okay, so these must be like old school Japanese candies, like maybe from the good old days, you know what I mean? Let's no, try. I don't. Yeah, so this is kind of like rock candy, the ones that are kind of crystallized. It's like little pieces of sugar almost. Like you can throw these in your coffee and just like <laughs> drink your coffee. They're good. Mm. Uh -huh. That's delicious. All right guys, and these are the two snacks that we have left, but I want you guys to vote which snack we should try in our next video. We this was awful. This was, uh, this is, this is a zero. I hate this. This is one of the worst videos I've ever seen in my whole life. Okay, this is Eva Violet. These down bad TikTok comments hurt my soul. She's pretty.
Oh my god, I'm so happy to be back. Look at me. Are you Irish? Has to be Scottish or Irish. What are, What is What is that accent? I'm not... Me having two videos up in the space of a week. What? Are you kidding? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're doing it. So yeah. I asked my wonderful mod and friend Ren to and find me the worst, down bad, creepy comments Ren. I've had on my TikToks. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. Yeah. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea, but I figured it'd be a fun thing. Because it makes you money and it gets you views, right? We all know why you're doing it. Don't lie to your audience. It insults their intelligence to go and do it with you guys so we're gonna go for them together so and awesome. oh god if you've if, if you've been at my tiktok comment section you will know the monstrosities that come from that place it terrifies me i can't lie some of the comments are nice but jesus fucking christ it's intense what's with your language such vile language it's not necessary I really am expecting to be like extremely traumatized from today's video. I'm like scared. Like I take like one look at my comments and I'm like, what? It's just filled with mommy comments to be honest. But there are some that are really fucking bad. So we're gonna go through those today. I am excited and nervous. Also, shameless self promo. I'm now on Cameo. So if you guys want any like personalized messages from me, that's where you get them. So hit me up on there. And while you're at it, go follow my other socials. It'll all be in the description. Yeah. Okay. What is a Cameo? I don't know really. Let's get started. So the way we're going to go about this is I'm going to show you guys the video first and then we're going to go through the comments on those videos and see what people have to say. Okay. I don't want to get flagged. I'm going to mute that. Kind of flash. Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I think that would be against community guidelines and also fuck off yo yo you forgot to flash is this is this all this one's gonna be because I put a flash warning I swear to god there's mm. been times I forgot to put a flash warning and everyone's like oh my god I put a flash warning put a flash warning which is so valid and then I put a flash warning and I get comments like this are you kidding me please stop please stop I'm not going these are valid criticisms there's no flash in the video so the comments rightfully have the right to mock you. I get mocked all the time for my videos. Y you live and you learn and you deal with it. I'm going to flash you. This is not Pornhub. I love you. All of my- Pornhub? What the- what? Where did that come from? Where did- how did you get from A to Z? body is dedicated to loving you i would sell my cousin to meet you that's pretty good that's a good one that guy is so jerking off to you every night lady you know it i know it and the rest of the internet now knows it you would sell your cousin. That's Loki a good segue though to promote the fact that I am going to be at Annie Manga Pop in August. So if you guys do want to meet me, I'm going to be in Glasgow doing meet and greets and having a nice time. So <laughs> you can meet me then if you want. You do not have to sell your cousin. Don't worry, mother. Flash me whenever you would like to. Fuck off. Why are all of these comments about me flashing people? So that is the first video that we have reviewed. Um, Let's Flash. move on to the next. <laughs> me a fairy doing e-girl things oh mommy i can't anymore what is with the mommy stuff i'm no one's mommy why do people keep saying mommy yeah she doesn't seem old enough for that like i wouldn't i wouldn't i don't even get it she's probably a similar age to me right let's be honest here like i've made a tiktok literally about this like i do not get what the whole mommy thing is about like i am not a big head is it because your boobs jiggle up and down but like my, look my boobs i can make them jiggle up and down am i a mommy is that all it takes 
Daphne, Dom, Mommy, Creator. I am four foot eleven. I am like shy as fuck. I have crippling anxiety. Like, what makes me mommy? Like, there's nothing mommy. Ab- what is mommy about this? Make it make sense. I don't get it. I genuinely don't get it. Please, someone explain because on that video, literally no one explained. Everyone was just like mommy. Then people started calling me stepsis, which I did not like. It's not November. Stepsis. You can see it. I can see it. I can look. I know you don't like it, but that's a valid point versus mommy because stepsis is probably a similar age. At the same time, though, men, you're gross. Okay, don't be stepsis and any girls on the internet. Don't do that. Okay. What? I don't get. Oh, the lady hasn't been on the internet long enough. You all know who's fapping tonight. It's that guy. Because it's not no vipper. <laughs> get it. Wait, what? No! Ew, what? Like You knew exactly what it is. She was making a joke. No, not November? Which means you can not, you still can't not, not over me. Bruh. If you don't respond, we are dating. Oh, sorry, I, I misspoke. If you don't respond, we are dating. Well, I didn't respond. Technically, this is a response now. So I guess we're not dating. I'm sorry, goofy ass sound, I'm sorry. I guess we're not dating. I guess we're not. Okay, next video. That was really- no, no! Son of a fuck! Bro, what? What's happening? That was the worst Turns video into I an ever emo. Saw. That was pretty. That was actually kind of funny. I am a hot emo boy with painted nails, piercings, and rings. I'm literally winning. You are winning, but I don't like your username. I am in your walls. Someone told me they were in my walls last video, and it's made me a little bit anxious. I hope no one's in my walls. Fun story, actually. There was a hamster. Are you loony, loony? You think someone's in your walls? Why would you think that? You're a human being, right? You know what, like, what's right and what's what's possible, correct? They're living in my big sister's walls. She had to, like, drill a hole in her wall to get the hamster. Um... It was a, it was a, it was a weird time. Beautiful mommy, thank you, son. No, I'm actually kidding. Stop calling me mommy, princess. There's always me. I swear, God, I made one video talking about how I like being called princess. <laughs> now everyone calls me princess. Wait, okay. Shit. Now I am princess. <laughs> Fuck off. I do not change for a woman. Anyways, how you all like my new black gut hairs and piercings? <laughs> Wow, I love What? What does that have to do? What do the any of these have to do with the video? If you're leaving a comment on a TikTok, what are you doing with your life? They're like five seconds long. What are you commenting on? <laughs> that one's actually quite funny. See, sometimes the down bad comments are fine, but sometimes they're just creepy, and I don't like. Why is there? I swear to God, see with the gems on my face and my eyelashes, like my hairs get caught to like, to like my eyelashes and stuff, like the eyelash glue and the little yeah. gems, and it always just like my hairs are like stuck to my face, and it's really annoying. <laughs> Anyways, that one. Did you just pout? You're not five. You're a grown ass woman. Almost funny, I approve. Why did nobody tell me my hair was sitting weird? What? I went on to look at how the tiara looked on me, and now... Whatever. Whatever! She did whine. Stop, you're not a child. Start acting like a a person your age. Mommy with a ring. Here's me talking about my stutter. 
and you are proposing. That is real commitment. Thank you so much. Marry me, mm. mommy, please. I don't want to marry you. Marriage is a sham. 50% of marriages end in divorce. Do you want to be divorced from me? And that's what's wrong with America at the moment. But marriage, dude, you know, when you're married, you also live longer. If you're happily married. So is it worth your 50% chance, lady? You may live longer. Also, um, don't ask people to marry you online. That is very uh, creepy. Wow, wow, that's actually quite toxic. Mommy, please step on me. No! I'm Did you just say toxic? Also, who's stepping on who here? She's like, she's four foot eleven. What's she gonna do? I'm not gonna step on you. Well, the only thing I step on is spiders that invade my house. Okay, next video. These hurt my ears. <laughs> Okay, so I just made this video on the bus and I was honestly really embarrassed because someone fucking like <laughs> Why don't you drive? You're you're a grown adult. Get a car, drive. I drive an Acura. It's really nice. Get a car, drive. Don't take the bus. Someone walked on the bus because the bus is stopped like when I was making it. Someone walked on the bus and then started to walk towards me but i was near the back so i didn't think they were gonna like actually come up and see me they did like they walked they walked up to me and i looked up and i was like oh my god and then they walked past me and i was like oh my god are you actually being serious like i'm just being an eager on this bus i am early can i get a meow <laughs> excuse me you want me to meow for you i'm not meowing for you i'm sorry but i i simply refuse okay guys that's it for this video um i am deeply deeply traumatized and upset i swear you guys are like you say some intense stuff i can't no they didn't no they didn't they have how long have you been on the internet there is way worse stuff people have said those were pretty tame okay like has anyone asked you if they could be eaten by you and sit in your stomach, huh? Alright. Have anyone asked you to stuff a liver up your vagina? A cow liver? No, I don't think so. Those aren't the comments you were getting. So you know what, lady? I don't really want to hear it. Because those are pretty normal comments. Alright? You can get way worse. Way worse, okay? Okay? Like, I'll needle you everywhere. Right, those were where you want to be needled, huh? Way worse. Those were pretty tame, not at all traumatizing, in the slightest. Don't lie, I do love you all with all my heart, and not all of the comments are like that. Some are lovely, and some are hateful, and some are very different. But you know what? I love you all. Okay, I love no, you, you all, don't. but some of you really need That's to touch some grass. Okay, in fact, in fact, I'm going to set a challenge for you right now. Leave the house right now and go touch some grass. If you have ever left a comment like that on anybody's posts, go touch some grass. It will do you a world of good. Okay? If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe. I was outside on the farm today. Also, I don't really leave comments, so that wouldn't happen. Why are you projecting, lady? I feel slightly offended. Turn on notifications, it would mean the world to me. I really, really like doing YouTube. Um, so we're definitely gonna be doing it more. I yeah, I like this one, for sure. That was pretty good. Okay. This is Julia Birch. And then the next one's Lauren Birch. And welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is probably my most highly requested video. Oh yeah, that, that was a 10 out of 10. The last one it was pretty good. This is my mom reacts to my weird DMs too. Here we go. Video, I did a part one um, to this video. I think it was like over a year ago. It was a while ago. Yeah, for sure. Um, and you guys loved it. And so many people- This makeup is awful. You look awful. What are you doing? Too much blush. You look like someone punched your eyes.
People have been asking me for a part two. I got such good feedback on the first video. So if you haven't seen that video, go check it out. This is my mom. Hi. Hi. If you think you're going to like this video, then leave a thumbs up right now. You're gonna like it. It does seem very sexual. <laughs> It doesn't make sense. So it's not it's not a gross one. We're starting it off kinda kind of okay. Tame. <laughs> We're starting tame. Okay, what am I reading? This part? Yeah. Okay. You don't have to read that. He was just responding to my story. What is your work? Show his gloves, toilets, all the day is not a work. What? I don't understand. <laughs> I think he's trying to ask like what I do for work, but I don't my work doesn't involve gloves or toilets. So he's just way out in left field. And <laughs> Oh, she doesn't get it. That's pretty sick, dude. None of you look it up either. Has no idea how to write correctly. Can you stupid and dumb? <laughs> So mean. Maybe he just wanted to confuse us. Maybe he wanted to get into the video. That's true. I always wonder, I'm like, is this real or like, are they trying to get into the video? Because uh, <laughs> some people do that. Some people on Twitch like purposely say things in chats mm -hmm. to get banned so they can be in the unban request video. Really? Yeah. Thicker, fuller hair starts with hymns. Discover sprays. Huh. People are weird. Yeah, it just says green. Green, 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 green. Did it make like a whole picture? No, that would have been cool though. Yeah, I was expecting to see like a penis or... A penis. I bet uh, Julie's here to see many peni in her day in these DMs. You know. Yeah. Like so a creative dick. Do that. I never once want to hear my mother say a creative dick pic. How. You stop that right now. She's so wholesome. I saw a video talk. I think it, I saw it on like it was, a, it was a meme. Like, don't you think the citrus would irritate? Ew. Nice, okay. sweet, green heart, pussy body, female <laughs> like, like it, sweetie, heart, heart, heart. Like, fuck you often in that position, like in picture, whatever emojis. Look sweet, director, author, envier. Like, fuck you both, two birch girls often. <laughs> okay. That's a lot. That's a lot. That's a lot. Yeah, it's like he was trying to be poetic or something, See, but it didn't work out. Like in picture. <laughs> that is more of the comment I expected from e girls on the internet. Absolutely. With that, there's something in my eye. No, I'm trying to make a joke. Stop it. Oh. So, uh, that was more what I expected of comments of e-girls. Absolutely. Yeah. Men, don't do that. Don't send those to girls. Because guess what? It doesn't work. They find you gross and offensive. Yeah. I will fuck you like in picture. <laughs> which picture? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> which one? <laughs> like, I don't even curse. I don't even write the F word. I don't even write the F word. The only, the only times I curse is when I make jokes and videos. As a joke. I don't even write it. I feel dumb when I'm reading them. That's why they're fucking dumb. Like. <laughs> <laughs> I feel dumb when I'm reading them. Well, yeah, yeah I mean, she's right. You're losing brain, brain cells. Yeah, it can't even. It's not even a sentence. It's not even like a, a basic sentence. It's nothing. It's just random fucking words. <laughs> I feel like they just feel like the like the recommended word thing yeah. at the top. Yeah, I just feel like some of these people aren't really speaking English properly. They're just speaking a different language and they don't know how to like. Maybe Google Translate is really bad. So maybe they were using Google Translate. Google yeah. Translate literally fucks everything up. Yo, can I set up Zoom meeting with your butt? <laughs> <laughs> I just have to look this. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> that's funny. Oh, yeah, that, that is, is funny. Cool. This one's gross. Do you do any kissing videos with your sister by chance? Are we in West Virginia? I was making a joke. Don't, don't.
don't hound me over there. Nasty! Nasty! A lot of people ask that. Really? Say what? <laughs> a lot of Editing's people ask that. Really mm. good. I like having a twin, but a lot of people think of it as a as a fetish. Mm. Which like I don't mm -hmm. I don't fetish shame, but as a twin, that's mm. You can fetish shame. Please fetish shame, lady. Let them know who's boss. No, that's crossing a line that just... It's also, like, illegal. <laughs> it's illegal, it's incest, it's just not what... This is. It's not gonna happen, so stop asking. Stop. Unless they really want to, and then that's fine, but they won't. <laughs> Such a supportive mom. You would let your daughters kiss on camera? I think she was making a joke. I don't think she would let that happen. That would be really gross. I'm so supportive. <laughs> Wiggle it for us. Trust me, not pulling out of either of you. Ew! Just tell me where to send the- Ew! 18 years of child support. <laughs> You're disgusting! Ew. You're a disgusting pig. Disgusting! I know, this was a public comment too. This wasn't even a DM. This was a comment on my TikTok video. Of me and Ew! Been banned? Been deleted, been blocked. Yeah, you, you're nasty. Like I can That's be as so sexual gross. as the next person, but like to take it to that whole level where That's it's just so like gross. so derogatory and gross and just I don't know. I'm a Ew. fan. I want to bang you so bad. Can I please have a picture? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we're not supposed to swear on YouTube, right? Yeah, please don't swear. <laughs> this person, like these men, have mothers. Like, what would your mother think if she knew you were saying and writing things like that? And she's absolutely right. Absolutely. And what would your priest or, or whatever religious person think? Huh? Huh? Something you want to confess to me? Mr. Deacon? That's me? You want to tell me something? I've actually, I had people come to me and tell me stuff like this. That they like gave a thousand dollars like a uh, there was a person I support group that gave a thousand dollars to a woman on OnlyFans. Don't do that. Please don't. Please don't do that. Ah, you guys. On Chewy, save 35% off your first order with selection for any dog with any diet. Not good. That's why they do fake accounts. Yeah, because you don't want your mama to know what you're up to. How do you sleep at night, you pervert? I'll screenshot it and then send it to their family member. <laughs> I think I did that one time. I think like someone sent me a message, so I like sent it to their girlfriend. Yeah, no girl. She answered me though. No, she was too busy killing yeah. her boyfriend. Yeah. <laughs> I would drag my balls across a hundred miles of broken glass just to hear you fart through a walkie-talkie. <laughs> I get that funny. <laughs> Yeah. If there was a prize for the best one, so far this one is it. This was the best one. <laughs> yeah, because it's like, I'll sacrifice you. Like, that's the ultimate sacrifice. And he's not even... Yeah. If you're not a man, which I know most of you aren't, balls hurt real bad. You have no idea the amount of pain my balls are in all the time. So having them go through broken glass to hear a fart... That's a real dedication. Also, who would do that? I would never. Not for any woman. Ever. Not even if it was like a supermodel. I've been asking for much. Yeah, he's not, he just wants to hear me for a while. Leave this video a thumbs up if you've ever dragged your balls through Sorry. broken glass. Yeah, <laughs> if you would drag your balls through gro broken glass, how many miles? A hundred miles for a girl. It's not even possible. They would be tore off beforehand. Well, or someone you love, then comment down below. Yep. We want to know how many men are willing to drag their balls through broken glass for someone they love. Yeah. I'm going to ask Kurt when I go home. <laughs> Do it. If he asks you to marry him, you have to ask him, would you drag your balls through broken glass for me? And if he says yes, then you say yes. <laughs> Well, I guess I'm never marrying these ladies because I would never say yes. Ever. Yeah. Uh, mm mm. No one's no no one's going near those balls. Yeah. Yes. And you walk down the aisle, but he has to. Ah! <laughs> these two are funny. You know, it's kind of weird that now I'm jacking off to girls younger than me rather than way older than me. Laugh out loud. Ew. Thank you for your confession. You're disgusting. Yeah. Ew. That's like, oh, hey, I'm a pedophile. 
come get me. Like, you're a loser. You're a fucking piece of shit. Ooh. Now I'm mad. <laughs> No, I'm just <laughs> I wanna come on you while Lauren watches and joins in while I get hard again and explode. Yeah, I'm gonna vomit now. <laughs> Ew. What am I nervous? That was hysterical. Man, maybe one day there'll be comments of me. They'll be like, mm, look at that white Italian boy on the internet. His body's good. That's how unoffensive I am. I can't even make a sexual comment. That's funny. So bad. I think I'm gonna puke, dude. No, man, you can't puke because if you puke, I'm gonna end up- Do you accept to be my girlfriend and get married? I love you as many raindrops Ready to come to your country and live there. <laughs> Guys. Guys, do we have more self-respect as a species? Like, don't write these things. Please. Human decency. Or, like, don't show off your mental retardation. I love those ones. I will come to the country and live there with you. <laughs> yeah. Will you marry me? It's just so they like, is he, is he a prince? He must he be a prince, prince or must somebody. Prince. If he thinks that, you know, he can just ask you, you will say yes and he will move here and you will live happily ever after. I, I want to be a princess. Yeah. Be fun. Are there any princes out there? <laughs> Julia would like to meet you. Seriously, please. Oh my God. I don't know if I can read this one. Okay, it's just disgusting. We'll put it off on the screen. I mean, it can't be any more disgusting. Than the rest of them. Yeah, we could do that. Eh? That's it. You guys, you guys can read it. Hey, do you want to be my girlfriend? I just don't know how to speak English <laughs> very well, but I think we managed to, we managed to overcome it with a lot of love. I knew, I just thought it was funny because he's just like, we can overcome it with love. Yeah, who does need English? Does is me. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna work out. Like it was, it was kind of lighthearted and cute. Yeah, yeah. He's like, we, I can't speak English, but like, that's okay. That's not cute. That's strange. Any person that says that over the internet is strange. Don't get it twisted, lady. These people are strange. <laughs> like, it was kind of cute. And even his writing in English is actually pretty good compared to some yeah. of the ones that it's you, Google Translate that we read, and it's like, oh my god, <laughs> he's okay. He's okay. <laughs> That's okay. You're yeah. allowed to say that, I feel. Yeah. So throw off your boobs, please. Like, throw off or throw out. <laughs> or show throw off? off? Maybe it's supposed to be show off your boobs, please. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Hello, you are very sexy. I want <clears throat> you sex for money. Do you have sex for money? How much do you want? Have you ever had anal sex? Ew. <laughs> Ew. Okay, so he just thinks that you're a prostitute, essentially. So that's fucking rude. As if you would even say that to my daughter. Like, you're a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, like this, he, this is my business email list. Like, my manager probably wrote that. Like, oh, God. <laughs> yeah, your poor manager. Yeah, I don't go through my emails. You don't go through your own emails? Why? Why do you not go through your emails? You pay someone to go through your emails? Anyone reading this kit? I don't go through my emails for my business emails. So if you're trying to ask me if I've ever had anal sex via email, my manager will read it. Yeah. <laughs> and he will not answer you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, let me know if you want to see a part three. Are we down to do a part three? <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I would definitely be down to do part three. Only because you're asking me and I love you, so I you would have, do it for you. You have fans, okay? And I, I have fans. And thank you to my loyal fans who love me so much. <laughs> this video gets, gets 100,000 likes. My mom will start a YouTube channel. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah, also, I was thinking of doing a, a live stream on Twitch where my mom goes through my unbanned requests for me. <laughs> Alright, pretty good. Uh, 10 out of 10. That was hysterical. I love it. Alright, sister, this is Lauren Birch. Lauren? Lauren? I don't know. Uh, she only uploaded try-on videos, so... 
This is a try on video of anime lingerie and clothing. I had to put one of these in here eventually. They all have these try on videos. I didn't want the whole video to be these. So here we go. Hey guys, it's Lauren Birch here today back with another video. Today we are doing a try on haul with the company like Meow Cost. They have some really cute stuff on their website. Some cosplay related items and just normal clothes. You can check it all out. I have a variety of stuff here. I have like some costumes, a cute outfit, and Sounds a cool. little cute onesie. So I'm excited to show you guys. Make sure you check them out in the description box down below if you're interested in purchasing anything. I'll leave a link. For oh, it, is it sponsored? Are we sponsored? Okay, so the first item is some lingerie that is kind of cosplay themed. So it's basically a kitty inspired lingerie piece and it's so cute. And I love all the straps going through. I think it's really interesting. We have this baby pink see a woman in frill mesh on the side, okay. which is just adorable. This design is very flattering. The back has this adorable paw print etched into it, which is really well That's done as well. There's also some strings that you can create is a this bow even in the back. Clothing? Or you probably tie it around your waist if you want to. And this is the top. It's the same black and pink. And it actually has a space in the middle, which is uh, shaped like a little cat. Really cute. And it has the pink etched in on the side. The most adorable lingerie I've ever owned. And if I had a twin, we would share clothes all the time. Really excited to try it on. And then it has this choker with a little bell. It's really cute. That's adorable. And then, of course, we have the classic kitty ears. Oh, These also have the same golden bells yes, on them. Of course. There's some bows in pink to match with the lingerie. And the ears are also pink, and the rest is black. Very fluffy and cute. Let's try on the kitty lingerie. Tattoo here, tattoo here. It's fine. Why? I mean. Okay. This woman's trained to be a model before. Do you see these poses? Do you see the poses she's done? These are poses that we had to go through all the time. When I was in the agency, she's she's done this before professionally. Absolutely, no question. She knows what she's doing. Yeah, one hundred percent. She's went to a professional modeling modeling agency and learned to do this. I love the red and black together. I think red and black is a perfect color combination. So you have these two straps here. This red choker kind of goes around your neck. And then there are also these straps here. So you can see at the back right here, there is a little button so you can clip the straps. I'm unsure why they like decided to do that, but I, I like think it might be blue. good if you want to wear it strapless or something. Maybe you can remove hair. it and just but I, I would, And the back has this stretchy you know, material, which is awesome to see. I love adjustability in clothes, as I always say. This is the second piece to the outfit. As you can see, it's a very, very high-waisted skirt. We have some black lace at the end of each layer, which is really nice. And there's also these same belt loops, which is really interesting. They go all the way around so it looks like you'd wear these as sort of overalls which is so cute i love overalls i actually went through an overall phase in high school and these also have shorts built in which is always great to see she seems right, much more innocent than julia set. nope this is a goth type does not fit her at all not even a little bit this looks awful on her it's not her it's not her style she is much more of a uh Cutes-esque, not goth type. Not for her. Mm -mm. That's unfortunate. It. I don't think it would look terrible on someone else though. Yeah, weird. X O. Tattoo here. Tattoo here. They both, they both have a rose. I saw Julie have the uh, rose on her left arm. 
This is a very interesting I, that's a neat touch. The sisters are must be very adorable. close then. I actually have these exact flowers to group in your hair. So this is the corset top slash bodysuit. There's beautiful flowers on the front. I love this costume a lot. The red velvet in the front feels very nice. And then you have the gold stitching going down. Then you have these beads right here. The back can be laced up, which is good because you can loosen it or tighten it. And then we have the bodysuit. Very interesting. I love the gold and red together. I think it's very royal feeling. And I'm excited to see how it looks. Okay, I believe this goes Royalty? on your arm, but I could be wrong. But I think you just put it on your arm right here. And then it opens up into this very long and flowy sleeve. Very cute, I like it. <laughs> and it has the same gold beads all around. And here's the other one. And then there's also some golden leaves coming out. I believe this would be the choker. I was always into fashion. It I did I did has a, Velcro right a here, lot of so modeling and stuff in high school and a little bit after as well in college and I also did training girls and uh, judging modeling shows for a while so if you ever want to see videos of me judging like try-ons and stuff we could do more of these maybe not lingerie or anything like that but like actually fashion and easily. I find Velcro is the best for chokers. Very easy I wouldn't, to use. I wouldn't Sometimes the clasp can be very hard to get. And then I these look like the knee socks. Very, very cute. We have the bros and the flower on both sides. I really love the flower theme going on here. Yellow and orange designs down here. I'm really excited to see how the costume looks. I think it's going to look wonderful. So let's try it on. Oh, yeah, for sure. This fits her absolutely. Fits her wonderfully. I would say this fits her more than both the cat costume and the last one. Absolutely wonderful. This this is a gorgeous outfit. Gorgeous for her. Phenomenal. It's a shame. It's a shame that you can't see her walk in it. Like walk down. It'd be easier to tell. Well, hold on. It makes her back look a little dimpy. Something's a little off here. Her front looks good. Her back's... The, these... These right here would need to be shaved off a little bit. Yeah, if you shave this off a little bit, it'll be better. It's a, it makes it look too big. It makes her butt look ginormous. Not good like that. Now we have this really adorable. Also, the choker is very thick, a little too now thick. We have this really adorable and very comfortable onesie. So here's the hood. And then you have these sleeves built in, which is really cool. And it's a nice black and red. We have the Emily logo on it. And Little this cat really time. cute cat zipper. I love that a lot. And it zips pretty far down, which is nice. The pockets are my favorite. They are cat paws and it's adorable. I love the fluff as well. And then here's the bottom. Just a nice little onesie. I could see myself lounging in this if I'm taking a day off, just watching animated or something. Super cozy. You don't watch anime, don't lie to me. I don't even watch anime. Unless I'm trying to do a video or something. And I think don't it's really cute. I love the black and red. So let's try it on. I mean, if you're married for a spouse, this is a spouse outfit. But like, this is after you're married. Oh, it has a little cat thing? You know, not necessary. Oh, uh, with the hood off, looks significantly worse. Yeah, I hate that. It looks like grainy panties, too. You yeah. know. Yeah, way worse. All right, that brings us to the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and comment what your favorite piece was down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, so like 7 out of 10. This was a good video. 
I should put a lot of effort into it. But um, that's all the e-girl videos I have for today. I don't ever want to see an e-girl again. I'm done. All right. Unless I see one in person, I go to a convention and I see someone in person, I'm done. Please, I'm not taking any more e-girl links for, for Twitch or anything. I had enough e-girls for a lifetime. And now we're in 34 minutes of too many. Okay. I'm sure there's someone that watches e-girl videos all day and all night and just watches try-on hauls. Because every single girl has a try-on haul. It's just not me. Okay, I, I really don't want to see and need to see any girl in a bunch of different outfits. Because I just don't care. But that's just me. But uh, I want to thank everyone for watching. I really appreciate you all going through this suffering with me. I think multiple people have said it in this video. Do subscribe. It really helps. I'm trying to get to 500. And um, the second thing is do uh, know that the next theology set is being made. As of this time, Hell of a Boss is over. There's no theology videos come out as I'm recording this. But uh, I do know what's next, what's coming out. So stay tuned for that. And I'll start working on those here soon. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching and have a good one. Peace.